Oh my god. Oh my gosh, guys. What the heck? Oh crap, the stupid keyboard. I literally I'm sitting here on this couch. This is you guys have seen so many videos where I've <coughs> sorry, I've been sick all day. I literally have like been terrible, terribly sick. I literally sit on my freaking couch and I just open like one or two packs and I just freaking pull absolute heat. Literally look at this. 98 Alshon Jeffrey. This is the limited time Alshon Jeffrey. <coughs> Bruh. What? This is actually insane. Holy crap. I can't believe I pulled this. Okay, let me get out. I'm gonna... So as you can see, you see the card. This... I hate this stupid keyboard. It literally just, like, pops up all the time. If you're an iOS user, you probably have the same experience. Alright, we're back in. Let's log right. Let's get back into our league. By the way, if you guys are trying to get, be consistent and you're a good overall and score, come join my league. You may you see it right there. <coughs> um, but here... Oh, my God. Let's go to the chat. Literally... 98 Alshon Jeffrey. Bro, this dude is so good. His boo, he even has boosts and he's a limited time. I opened one 60k pack. I haven't played Madden Mobile at all today. I literally just come on. I just literally opened up one pack. I'm like, screw it. Like, I have a few coins. Holy crap. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to cut back to me real time now. It's probably a day later. Um, but this is absolutely insane. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a brand new Madden Mobile video. We got the Willie Brown Legendary Pack opening, and we about to get right into it. So hopefully, we're trying to pull some of the Super Bowl elites, maybe even Pro Bowl or Playoff elites, within these 10 packs. And then at the end, we get ourselves the 99 overall Willie Brown. Now, Willie Brown is a corner that is six foot one, which is okay for a corner. Of course, I have Mike Evans out of position, which is 6'5", which I think is the best corner in the game his height is so crucial um, for a good cornerback so i'm super pumped to get into this see what like what goes on with these legendary packs is anything worth it of course there was, i believe was a franco harris running back um yesterday every single day there's going to be a new master legendary player of course if you're trying to get um the mvp or the 98 tom brady do not invest in this it's going to be a waste of your time this is more for those who like to spend a lot of money or for those who just like to watch awesome packs that's what today is going to be so without further ado let's go ahead and slide right into this bad boy we got legendary pack Let's see what it contains. We get a Super Bowl legend, Willie Brown collectible. We get James White. We get a bunch of badges. Um, and then we get Eric Lee, Rodney McLeod. So it looks like we get golds, badges, and of course a guaranteed badge every time, which goes into the set to get one of the rare legend players. Here we go. We into pack two, Willie Brown legendary pack two. We got something right there. Any elites, please give us something. We got Landon Robert, James White, Chris Hogan, and Rodney McLeod. So nothing too special out of the first um, initial packs but we have been getting the badges and the gold players, which are always nice to be able to complete some of those sets. Let's get right into it. We get Malcolm Brown, Super Bowl badge. We get Brent Selleck. Um, any elites? I don't see anything shaking so far. Cameron Fleming. We got an, our collectible, another Fleming, and a Malcolm Brown. So pack three. We're on to pack four now. One through three have been absolutely crap. Can we get at least one elite in this bundle opening, let's go. We got Chris Hogan, we got Jalen Mills, Malcolm Brown again. Pack 5 of 11. Let's get a legendary status pull. Let's just freaking pull Willie Brown. I don't even want to get the topper. I just want to pull him in the pack. Let's go. We got Super Bowl badge. We got Eric Lee. Come on, baby. Pack 6 of 11. You know what to do. Quick reveal all and a bunch more golds, the collectible, um, which you can add to the Willie Brown set. But nothing so far. So, so far, this has kind of been an L. We're on pack 7-Eleven. The quickest place to go snag a quick snack. Speaking of 7-Eleven, when I used to go to 7-Eleven, like two or three years ago because it was by my house i would always get the slurpees but i always went for the coca-cola i'm not messing with those like berry or red slurpee flavors i was 100 percent coca-cola and pina colada mix that thing was freaking thick so juicy i love slurpees ronnie mcleod it's literally like 50 cents for just like a gallon of just like pure sugar but hey it was worth it let's go brent Selleck. we got Vinny curry dead oh so bad literally terrible packs what is this like what even is this it's 
We can't even pull anything. Now we're on pack 9 of 11, and of course EA likes to troll, so they're probably going to give us something crazy on 9-11 because that's what they do. We get Super Bowl Legend Willie Brown collectible again, pack 10 of 11, the final legendary pack. If we don't pull crap in this one, I'm about to go open up the stuff on my bench right now because this is freaking triggering. This is totally not worth it. I would much rather open up the freaking Super Bowl packs, um, the Super Bowl bundle for like 5,000 Madden cash than this crap because you're just basically, it's like a build up to getting your Willie Brown. So you're just paying for your Willie Brown. Of course, there's content in the packs, which, you know, allows you to complete more sets and get closer to Masters. But uh, to be honest, if you are, you know, someone who pays out to play, I would not complete this. I feel like it's a waste of your time. You go ahead and just grind the Legend Live events. You guys will be able to get enough to probably complete one of the Legend sets, getting like a Franco Harris or, you know, a uh, freaking Willie brown 99 overall willie brown this is the same card art as like one or two years ago so this is freaking clutch plus two man to the entire lineup i am freaking pumped to see this let's go into the bench real quick and see if we can get anything fun screw it let's just go be sure to leave a like and subscribe i'm freaking pumped we are about to get a bundle giveaway going on um i'm setting up the gleam.io so stay tuned for that coming very soon 92 overall lane johnson already off the bat anything above 90 is fantastic um because we could get those you know crap 80 to 88 overall pulls but we got 92 lane johnson what's in this one right here 86 Bro, that thing was shaking like it was like a Rob Gronkowski. But 86, Dietrich Wise Jr. And the third one to end off the pack opening video. Let's go ahead and get another Wise Jr. So I think I'm going to go ahead and put Willie Brown in the nickel position. And I'm actually going to use this Danny Amendola that I got from uh, the, the Pick'em Bracket to train him up because I don't really need Danny Amendola. He hasn't really been selling too good for me. So I thought might as well just freaking get Willie Brown freaking juiced for the squad. Take a look at the stats already. We're still leveling him up and we're at 105. We're jumping to 106 with Willie Brown. We got 105 speed, 106 man coverage. We got 104 zone, 100 agility, 105 excel, 101 awareness. Coming in at 6-1, here is Willie Brown. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, be sure to slap a like, leave a like. I love you all so much thank you for participating and watching the videos commenting leaving your feedback um follow me on instagram at madden mobile slay i got some cool custom super bowl cards i'm making it's gonna be freaking pumping i love you all and i'll catch you in the next video peace out hey she said do you love me i tell her only partly i only love my bed and my mom i'm sorry